I should take a look at my dossier on the canopic chest and review my notes. My carry-on bag. I bought this gun in Cairo when I first landed. It seemed advisable after the fiasco in Spain. I wish I were more comfortable using it. I suppose I'll have to take lessons the next time I'm home. How thrilling. If I'm going out on the streets, I suppose I should take this with me. Mr. Masri recommended this hotel, said it was pleasant, and right next to his shop. In point of fact, it's a pit. On the other hand, at least I can get a look at his shop before our meeting tomorrow. I could use some sleep, but I should look around the neighborhood and try to learn something about Masri before our meeting tomorrow. It's a stock photograph blown up and printed at a local print shop, and badly framed. That's a closet. A wire hanger. About what you'd expect in a place like this. I don't have a reason to carry around a wire hanger at the moment. Here's a general rule. Nothing valuable ever comes in wicker. A public trash can. There's nothing I need in that trash can. There's nothing I need in that trap. I wonder how long that car has been sitting there. Since the Nixon administration, perhaps. That's Mr. Mosry's shop. Not exactly high-end. I need to learn more about Mosry before our meeting tomorrow, so I can anticipate how much trouble he's going to be. I don't have a need for motor oil at the moment. Cairo Youth Hostel. Thankfully, I've never had to stay in one of these. It's closed for the evening. Greetings, sir. Would you like a room? No, I just thought I'd look around. I'm sorry, but you can't enter unless you're staying here. I need to see a registration card. What do you need to see to let me in? A hostel registration card or a credit card to get a room. I don't need a room. I'm already booked at the glorious Seven Wonders Hotel.
That door looks like it's been through a nuclear war. I don't know what's in that building, but I'm fairly certain I don't need to go in there. A Roman aqueduct. It connects to the Nile River and was quite the achievement in its time. It's no longer in use, but it's impressive that it's still standing. An open-air garbage pit. How convenient. It's such a waste of energy to have to lift a lid. I don't have a need for... Looks like a private residence. Wooden crates. Impromptu seating. A lorry accident. That crate can stay where it is. Magnificent Cairo. What a fascinating city. Of course, the best parts of it are over there, and I'm over here. I don't need to go in there. Hookahs are used to smoke flavored tobacco. The smoke is filtered through water before it's inhaled, so there's no nicotine or tar. God knows what tobacco mix is in that hookah. If it even is tobacco. I'll refrain. Those two look like locals. Perhaps they know something about Masri. Those two look like locals. Evening, gentlemen. My name is Rector. Mind if I join you? Yeah, sure. Sit down. I'm Hasim. This is Sa. What do you need? Are you from around here? Oh yeah, I know Cairo real good. You looking for a tour guide, maybe? I can show you whatever you like. Good places to get laid, know what I mean? What do you like, Mr. Rector? Women? Men? Boys? That's not what I'm after. But thanks for the lesson in class. What? Oh yeah, no problem. Do you know Mr. Yusuf Masri? He owns a shop down the street. He 
Yeah, I know Mr. Masri. I know him very well. I know a lot of people. Oh? What can you tell me about Masri? The thing is, I don't know you. Know what I mean? You know what they say about talking to strangers. I must be going. A pleasure talking with you. Yeah, sure. I wonder what it would take for me to lose my stranger status with Haseem. I have a feeling it will involve money, if not humiliation. Let's just say that table suits this bar and leave it at that. They serve local beer and liquor. I don't want to drink. I need to be sharp for my meeting in the morning. It's a well-used dartboard. Hmm, it's a little chilly standing right here. my aim off. There's something I'm not accounting for. The bartender looks like a decent sort. Given his age and bearing, he's probably the owner. Good evening. Welcome to the Lady of the Dune, sir. What can I do for you? Is this your establishment? Yes, sir. For many years. You must know the neighborhood well, then. Yes, sir. I noticed the dartboard. Popular game in here? For those who can pay. Be careful playing Haseem, sir. He's been playing here for 20 years. He knows all the tricks. I'll keep that in mind. Do you know Mr. Youssef Masri? He owns a shop down the street. I know him. What can you tell me about him? Nothing. It's better to stay clear of offending that man. But talk to those two over there in the corner. Hasim knows him well. Thanks for the tip. Yes, sir. Hasim? Sir? Hey! Sit down, Mr. Rector. Do you play darts? Only a little. Want to play a friendly game? It's 50 bucks a game, US. I win, you pay me. You win, I pay you. What do you say? I'll play. Good, very good. Yalla. Yes, you did. Here. I'll be here any time you want to play again. Why is my aim off? There's something I'm not accounting for.
The posters are almost as bad as the wallpaper. That little air vent must be overworked trying to cool this entire place. I don't see any way to alter the air vent from in here. It's just a wooden cart. There's nothing I need to haul at the moment. A public trash can. There's nothing I need. It's a rather old-fashioned light switch. That didn't work. That air vent goes into the bar. I can't reach it. It's a dumpster for trash. It's a wooden shipping crate. reach it. That light is casting a shadow on this wall. It's too dark to see it. Those wires are disconnected. That didn't work. That building has a fire escape. That building... Has